Hi guys, welcome back to the Scan Tool Network. In this video, we're going to be looking at the best diagnostic tools and scanners for your Land Rover or Jaguar vehicle in 2021 and 2022. And at the end of the video, I'll show you which of these tools I would personally choose given my 15 years experience in this field. Now I'm going to put links to all of these kits in the description and in the pinned comment section. So be sure to follow those links exactly as they will take you to genuine and official products. Fakes and products do it, fakes and clones do exist. Uh, so please be very careful when looking at these tools. I'm going to start with the cheapest, working my way along to the most expensive. Um, generally, you'll find that the more expensive the tool, the more functionality, the more coverage it will have. But that's not to say that the cheapest tool that we have here today won't do a job for you just as well. It all really depends on your level of experience. Um, and it's all really about what you want to get out of a tool, depending on which tool you should actually go for. Okay, so um, we're going to start with the cheapest, as I say, this is the LR version 1.0 or Land Rover 1.0. I know it's called the LR 1.0, but it does cover Land Rover and Jaguar vehicles. Uh, and this tool will allow you to cover and diagnose and reset the main systems in your vehicle. So uh, this will cover things like engines, airbags, ABS, transmission. It will also allow you to diagnose and reset suspension fault codes, uh, maybe power steering, um, maybe fuel burner heater, something like that. This is seen as like an all system scan tool for the systems which are installed into that vehicle. Um, so this is a really, really good option and it is the cheapest option that we have on display today. When it comes to service functions, service, or, service functions are a little bit different to what we call as, uh, to what we class as a fault code reading scan tool. Um, the service functions on this tool, it only has one service function installed and that is to reset the oil service warning light or the service uh, overdue message. So if you, if you have one of those systems which need diagnosed or reset or you, you, you want to do the oil service reset, then by all means the LR version 1.0 may well be as far as you need to go. We then come on to the LR version 2.0. This kit will do everything that this kit will do, but this kit has additional special functions. So the additional special functions include things like electronic parking brake, DPF, that's diesel particulate filter, regeneration and reset, injector coating, ABS brake bleeding, electronic throttle reset, steering angle sensor, and new battery registration and reset. Now, it's important to point out that those functions I've just mentioned don't cover every single vehicle. So what you'd probably do is I'll put an email address in the description below. Contact the guys at Diagnostic World and they will confirm as to whether this tool is suitable for your vehicle for those special functions. The chances are these kits are going to be suitable for the diagnosing and the resetting of the systems like engines, airbags, ABS, transmission, uh, suspension, as I mentioned earlier. So that's the LR version 1 and the LR version 2.0 kits. We then move on to the iCarsoft EU Pro kit and you're going to notice a common theme here. As we go further up the line, the, the kit I'm talking about covers everything the previous kits have done. So this kit here, the ER, EU Pro kit, covers everything that these kits will do. You don't lose any functionality when coming across to this kit. However, this kit, it's a bit more expensive, but it's because it covers more manufacturers, more European manufacturers to be precise. So you may well have a Land Rover or Jaguar in your household that you wish to look after, but you may also have uh, extended family or friends, car, cars. They may have, I don't know, a BMW, a Mercedes, um, an Audi, a VW, a Vauxhall, something like that. So for the cases like that, where you want to look after European vehicles, then the EU Pro Kit may well um, serve your needs just that little bit better because it gives you a little bit more manufacturer coverage. And on the subject of extra manufacturer coverage, we then come to the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit. And this kit is, well, as I say, it's capable of doing everything that all of these kits will do. So it'll do all of the service resets, it'll do all of the special functions that are previously mentioned, it'll do all of the system coverage like engines, airbags, ABS transmission, but this will do it for all manufacturers. So all the European manufacturers, all the Asian manufacturers, all the American market manufacturers. So you've got things like Chrysler, um, 
Chevrolet, Jeep, GMC, etc. For the Asian market, you've got the likes of Honda, Toyota, Nissan, Subaru, Isuzu, Mazda, Mitsubishi, etc. So this is a really good option if you are looking to, maybe you just don't know what cars you're going to be diagnosing in the future. That's the iCarsoft CR Pro kit. And then finally along the line, we come to the Autel MK808 kit. This is the best kit out of all of these, and it also costs the most as well. It may well be, uh, price-wise, out of the reach of most DIYers, which I can totally see why. It's totally understandable. It is quite expensive. But with that expensive price tag, you do get a lot more functions than all of these. So this kit will do everything that all these kits will do, but you get 25 service items on this particular kit. So you'll also get the likes of... Um, what am I trying to say here? A gear learning. Uh, you'll also get... Um, suspension calibration and reset so the, there's 25 of them there as I say click the link in the below it'll show you everything that you need to know about this kit but this is the most expensive this is probably aimed at sort of small garages small workshops uh, maybe mobile mechanics people who just don't really know what kind of car they're going to be dealing with on a day-to-day -day basis but there's nothing stop you if you are a home DIYer and you want to jump straight into the deep end this tool will be perfect for your needs as well, so long as you can afford it. I suppose that's the main stumbling block over any of these car, any of these kits. You know, the, the, as we go along the line, the prices get more expensive, and it just really depends on what's suitable for you, your level of uh, experience, and the vehicles that you need to diagnose, the systems that you need to diagnose within those vehicles as well. And obviously, the price is a big factor. But which tool would I choose if it came to owning any one of these? If I was looking at sort of, um, if I was wanting the best value for money tool, I would definitely go for the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit. I would say this is probably just a little bit too expensive. This is the best value for money tool. You get the most service and system functionality, the most vehicle coverage and system coverage out of a tool with this particular kit here. So this is what I would recommend. This is my personal pick. But everybody's circumstances and needs are going to be different. Now remember the links to all of these kits are in the description below this video and also put them in the pinned comments. Follow the links to get genuine official products and if you do have any questions about these kits then I'll put the email address in the description below this video. You can contact the, uh, the guys at Diagnostic world who will gladly answer these for you um, so thanks for watching i hope it's helped you if it has please give it a thumbs up i'll see you on the next video at scan tool network